like you ever felt. Are you listening? Damn. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Uh. So what's up guys? I hope you guys are having a blessed weekend so far. Happy Easter weekend for those of you who are celebrating. I'm actually, I wanted to start the day with some aerial footage and we got Carson down there enjoying the Hi. beautiful weather. I mean, look at this, man. Beautiful blue skies. It's nice and warm. I mean, you really can't ask for anything else. And uh, I was supposed to meet up with a fan who had messaged me on Snapchat, said he wanted to come and uh, fly drones together, but uh, I guess he couldn't find me, so. Uh, to you, JJ, better luck next time. We'll get together, hopefully, sometime, fly the drones. Unfortunately, I have to go back up to the bar that we were at last night because I left my card. Like, when you start a tab at the bar, they keep your card behind the counter. And I left without it. So, I gotta go back up to Columbus and get my card. We've got Amanda and Amber here. We're making homemade sopapillas for dinner. Amber's rolling out the bread dough. Amanda's doing the hamburger. <laughs> I guess we'll just kind of teach you guys how to do this as we go. Okay, so Amber is still rolling the bread dough. We're having lots and lots of sopapillas. And Amanda, and I helped, we got all the hamburger brown. And now you just add taco seasoning. Um, How do you do the water? Just a little bit of water. Right. Like bit of water. Do you still do a pound or yeah. pound um, for your yeah. yeah. And yeah. because, because it's a little less than a packet of and it's not okay. Okay. Like, oh, seven yeah. pounds of meat on it, and I got five packets of You can't. So you want to go light on the top of seasoning and less on the water because the water will make it greasy. We've got lettuce for toppings, tomato for toppings. Thanks, Jess. Jessica showed up. Hey. Aunt Duck's here. We've got kids and guys outside. Got kind of stretched out. A scoop of hamburger. A hamburger with taco seasoning on it. Handful of cheese. And a handful of cheese. You just stretch it over the top. Pinch the edges. And then you take them and you drop them into your hot grease, which I don't think ours is hot enough yet. Um, and you deep fry them. Yeah. We're just using a pan with hot grease. You, if you have a deep fryer, you can put them in the deep fryer. This, Amanda brought her homemade salsa. How do you make your homemade salsa, Amanda? Um, you take a small onion, chop it up, a jalapeno, mm. A can of diced tomatoes, a can of Rotel, the original, some seasoning, cumin, some salt. A Mix it cannabis. all together. A little you, cannabis. You put it. <laughs> Once you get like, it'll you'll let it sit in the oil for a few minutes, and yeah, once you see the edges starting to turn brown, you'll flip it over, and then the, that's what it looks oh God, like. Isn't that awesome? Look, ah, look who made it home! I was out chasing hot air balloons. Yes, I got it, but it was a little far away. 
Salt. Very high up there. Yeah. yeah. How is it, honey? We ate like right before. This we is my first bite. Oh, we need to record that. That's really good. Yeah. Don't tell Amber I said that. Hold on. How you turn that thing on? How um how is it, everybody? Uh, good. Dead. Yo, those sober pias are so good. There's still quite a few left, right? Scott and Lindsay are coming over too. I told Scott, he's like, yo, you gotta have one of these. What are we doing tonight, Amber? Well, so it was in front. I can go see. Outside. In the dark. In the dark. <laughs> They're turned inside out. Excuse me? Oh. <laughs> you caught me looking at your, <laughs> your package, but the camera's there, so now I'm like caught red handed. Dang, man. I'm not. I love, I'm married. Like, I love my wife and everything. So, I'm not. <laughs> You know. <laughs> so as you can see, Scotty's here. Oh, uh, look at us. We're like just chilling on the floor, relaxing. They're over there relaxing. We got our family, our family out there at the table just chilling. Super fun, relaxing day. That's what this weekend's all about. It's a holiday weekend. Easter's on Sunday, right? That's correct. He goes, <laughs> Lindsay. I'm gonna pick your nose. <laughs> and we've moved forward a couple of hours and everyone's gone. Look, everyone's gone. This is the part of the parties that I hate when everyone leaves and then there's a big mess to clean. It's all good though. All, all in the spirit of hanging out with family. That's a small price to pay. But did you guys know that tomorrow... Colin, what's tomorrow? Easter. Yeah? What's, what's Easter about? What's Easter all about? Easter is about the resurrection of Jesus. When he died and he was put in the tomb and the angels came and he came, they went to the tomb and the tomb was empty. He had risen. The kids these days believe Easter is all about Candy, no chocolate, and peeps, and coloring books. Hey Carson, what? Why don't you tell everyone good night? Good night. Tell everyone good night, Colin. Good night, guys. <laughs> good night. <laughs> Would you look at this? We go upstairs to put the kids in bed, and by the time we come back downstairs. That sneaky little bunny must have already come down here and like made Easter happen for the kids. Silly rabbit. All right, so I hope you guys are having a blessed and happy, fun weekend with your families. Uh, for those of you who celebrate Easter, happy Easter. And uh, yeah, it's time for us to call it a day on this one. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching and we can't wait to see each and every one of you right back here for Easter.